And of course, everyone wants to know, you know, your thoughts on what the Clippers have done in getting Chris Paul. No, I mean, it's a great acquisition. I mean, it's it's tough. You know, Eric Gordon. I always think uh, extremely highly of him. And uh, you know, came in and had a, a year there where he played extremely well. And so it's tough to see them go. Um, you know, but Chris is he's a fantastic player. I mean, they, they've made a great addition. And of course, you know him personally. Oh yeah, yeah, I, I absolutely do. And uh, I know he's happy to finally move on with his career. And uh, instead of being stuck down in New Orleans, now he feels like he's at a place where. You know, he can play and compete, and, uh, you know, he's got Blake over there with him, so I'm sure he's very excited about it. I mean, you know, their roster looks extremely impressive, you know, and um, Chris is a great floor general. I'm sure they'll get after it defensively as well. You know, there'll be a lot of energy behind them. Uh, I'm sure they'll do more than well. Do people say, all the Clippers are more exciting now? I agree. Are you, no, can you, are you being sarcastic? No, you I agree. i definitely go watch them. You're not, you're not being Come on, man. Blake Griffin has like a 60-inch vertical, man. It's like, you know, Chris is vastly entertaining. I, for sure, I definitely check them out. It's, they're, uh, they're a team with a high motor, and young, and they run up and down the floor and this, that, and the other. Um, but I'm not concerned about that. I, you know, I'd okay, rather look at the jewelry. Except playing for a team that wasn't the, 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 the exciting most, team. Was, was the number one team in town, yeah. I like jewelry. <laughs> I, I don't I don't get into all that stuff man I like winning